Na forma governor of Lagos did Babaji Ndi Fashola has urged the governor, Babaji Ndi Sangolu, to prioritize the reclamation of the bus rapid transit BRT system and to expand the state's waterway transport infrastructure. Fashola stated this while making his delivery during the 2024 Lagos Physical Planning Summit which held in Lagos with the theme, Rethinking Lagos, a new vision for a regional and integrated mega city. Emphasizing the need for government intervention, Fashola highlighted the importance of regulating the operations of the BRT vehicles and prioritizing the transportation mode to achieve intermodal transport goals and address climate change challenges. Fashola pointed out that these vehicles contribute significantly to greenhouse gas emissions, contradicting the state commitments to combat climate change. Cycles and those many buses on Lagos roads are in clear conflict. They're in conflict with the many commitments we have made on climate change because of their high greenhouse gas emissions. And our partners, those we signed these agreements with across the world, must be watching us with some concern. Are these people really serious? I have no objection if the motorcycles can be turned to CNG, if they can be turned, the Korobe can be turned, and the federal government has, is proposing now very massive fiscal uh, reforms in terms of tax holidays, tax uh, remissions in clean energy sector of, of our environment. But I think something needs to be done. In response, Governor Babajide Somolu assured Fashola that the government's commitment or concept of an integrated public transport system is on track. Somolu announced plans to introduce an additional 2,000 compressed natural gas buses to Lagos by next year to revitalize the BRT Urban Mass Transportation Initiative. They're not fitting with uh, mass urban transportation system. We understand the feeling of our people. And so we were trying to reorganize them and put them at last mile positions, but not for them to begin to crowd our highways and our major motorways. So we believe that alternatives will be provided and adequate alternatives is part of the things that our rail, our water infrastructure, and now the PRT that will, will also you know, be given all of the commuters for public transportation in Lagos. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.